What's up, everybody? Punching out here. Taking a look at another game on Steam called Bomber Grounds Battle Royale. And the reason why we're going to talk about this game is because it's bringing me a lot of nostalgia vibes when I used to play Bomberman on the NES or the uh, Nintendo. And then I think it kind of went up to Sega Genesis or something like that. I remember playing a lot of Bomberman when I was a kid. But, anyway... <laughs> I do remember a lot of the skills, too, that the game, or Bomberman had, like the skull, or like if you got the glove, you could pick bombs up. If you had the, the kick bomb ability, you can kick bombs at people. Then they had, like, the super bomb, um, the bombs that had farther reach, the ones that light you on fire, all those types of ones. But in Bomber Grounds, there's only movement, there's planting bombs, and there's smacking stuff, like smacking bombs or smacking people. And because I'm a cat with a baseball bat, I can smack my bombs to other people. And there are, like, other abilities, like shield. You can run fast. You can um, get more bombs. You can get, like, a weird-looking pineapple bomb that does more damage or, like, a wider area. Like, I just killed the guy there. And you can smack people with your baseball bat and stun them so they can get stun locked and then uh, get killed by your bomb. And that's pretty much all you do. You just plant bombs against 25 other people, or 24 other people, and you win. And that's all you do. Honestly, for a free-to-play game, especially, like, this one, it's... I do like the art style. I do like the fact that you're playing little animals, and you're walking around planting bombs on people, and beating the shit out of each other with baseball bats. Um, I also like the fact that, being as a free-to-play, they are gonna try to go for I guess like microtransaction stuff but it's all cosmetic like getting your cat a, a weird hat or getting another character slash getting another weapon and I mean what do you got to lose honestly highly recommend it it's a fun game to play and he's got a decent community I've got like seven friends requests already probably more than I've ever gotten in Hunt Showdown so uh, I guess we'll just have to see but anyway guys I'm going to let go here. I'm going to let this play out until the end. If you like what you see, check me out on Twitch. I'm PunchOutTV. And, uh, yeah, hope you have a good rest of the day. I'll see you guys all later.